Welcome to another Minecraft Modern House tutorial. This one is a little bit hard, but it's not too difficult. So as long as you pay attention, you will be fine. So without further ado, get the materials and let's jump right in. Welcome back everybody. After a long four month hiatus, I am back recording Minecraft house tutorials. Let me know how much you guys want me to upload and I will do that. Just leave it in the comment section below. But today we're going to be building this house right here. And make sure you have the materials on hand because we're jumping straight into today's tutorial. So we're going to be using ourselves our quartz slabs and we're going to be starting right on the left corner. We're going to build one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're going to place two blocks of wood. And then we're going to build one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we did eight blocks here, left a gap of two, and then did seven blocks along here. Then we're going to come over to this part right here. And including this block right here, we're going to add two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So in total, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven blocks. Okay? And then on the 11th block right here, we're going to leave that. And then we are going to start building the rest of this. So for the rest of this, what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to take our wooden blocks. And we're going to want to build across here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And then we're going to want to place a wood all along here. Here we go. Um, there we go. And then we're going to want to build the wood all the way up until this point. So we're going to... Destroy all this block here, and we're going to place a wood all the way along here. So now, in this area here, all we want to do is we want to place ourselves some wooden planks. And this is the oak wood planks. So we're going to go do that right now. So as you can see right now, we have the first stage of this done. The next step we're going to do is we're going to do the right hand side. We're going to add four blocks along here. One, two, three, four. We're going to do the same over here. One, two, three, four. Now that that's done, we're going to get ourselves a grass block and we're going to fill in this area, all of this with grass. Start along the back, add another layer, and add another layer here, and add another layer here. So as you can see, that is that area there. Next, we're going to use our white concrete and we're going to start building over here. We're going to build up one, two, three, four, and then we're going to continue this all the way across by adding eight more blocks. So one, two, three, four, five. Wait, let's just count again. I confuse myself. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we're going to build all of this up. So as you guys can see in total, along here it should be 9 blocks. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And this should be up by 4 blocks. So now that we've done that, what we now need to do is we now need to continue on with this build. We're going to start by building the frame along here, along here, and around the back of the house. Let's start right here. What we should do is we should build up 1, 2, 3, 4. And then over here, we're going to build up 1, 2, 3, 4. Along the top here, we're going to connect it, as you guys can see, and then we're going to leave this window, we'll do that in a minute. Along this edge right here, what we're going to do is we're going to use our white concrete, so we're going to build 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and then we're going to build this up to the same height too. So now that that's done, done we're going to come over to this point right here, and we're going to place our stairs. So we're going to start with 2. Continuing up with two, going up again, and then going up again like this. Now that we're up here, we're going to also continue our build on. So we're going to come over to this point here and we're going to bring this across. And as you guys can see, the white concrete has attached to the building right there. Now what we're going to do is we're going to once again destroy this block, build up a layer of white concrete, and then add it all the way along here so that the stairs actually connects. Underneath the stairs, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to build a wall. So we're going to add some white concrete blocks, as you guys can see, and we're going to fill this area in. So there's that area done. And now, of course, we need to do the window area here, the window area there, and this area here. So... What we need to do now is we need to first of all make sure that we get ourselves our glass. So starting on the side here, 
So, we don't want to start building right here. We want to count backwards one and then build across one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then one, two, three, four. So, as you can see, we built four glass by three blocks high. Sorry, I got confused. And then we're going to use our grey concrete and place up one, two, three. And then place up one, two, three. In here, we're just going to fill this in with white concrete. And then as you guys can see right here, place another block here and place your door right here. Whichever door you want to place, place it right there. So now for the pool area, we're going to add the pool. We're going to count across here. We're going to count across four blocks. So we're going to go across one, two, three, four. And then we're going to come over to this point right here just before we touch the wall. One, two, three, four. Then we're going to join this up like that. Then we're going to destroy this area right here. And then, of course, inside this area, we're going to add the pool area. So we're going to add ourselves some wood. And then, of course, along the bottom of this, we're going to add ourselves some quartz. So as you can see, now that that's done, of course, we just need to add ourselves some water, which we'll be doing now. Let's add ourselves a bucket of water, add it, add it all along here, as you guys can see. And now that that's done, all we need to do is, of course, add the, the chairs. So we're going to add one here, and another one here, and then a place two blocks of slabs like that. So the next thing we need to do is right over here. We're going to use our grey concrete, and we're going to build up one, two, three. Come over to this point right here and do the same. One, two, three. And then um, we're going to look across here and we're going to build up one, two, three, and one, two, three, and then one, two, three, as you can all see. And now that that is done, we're going to obviously continue around the back part of the house. For this wall, we're going to want to extend it all the way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen blocks, and it should line up with this, as you guys can see. And then we're going to build this up to four blocks high. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And as you guys can see right there, we've got one, two, three, four blocks high. And that looks absolutely amazing. So, our next stage to do is to do the back part of the house, the second level, and the final level. So now that we're at the back of this house, what we need to do is we need to use our white concrete and build across all the way along here, like this. And then what we're going to do now is fill in this floor. So all along here, in this area, in this area, I'm going to fill it in with white concrete. So we're going to start by filling in, in blocks. So basically, um, I'll show you exactly what I mean. So from here, all the way to over here, we're going to add ourselves white concrete. And now, of course, you don't have the mod that I have, but um, that's where you want to place the white concrete. Then from here along to here is where you want to add your white concrete also. So there we go. And as you can see, that is all the white concrete that we need. Now that that is done, behind the house, we're going to add ourselves a back design. We're going to use one, two, three, four. Then we're going to use one, two, three, four, five. Then one, two, three, four again. And then we're going to leave it with two blocks like that. Now with this backwards pattern, we just need to build it upwards. So we're going to build this up, starting with the grey concrete. And then we're going to build this up as well. And then with the glass, we just need to also build that up too. There we go. Just like that. So as you can see, a very simple pattern. Now, the pattern we just did back there, we need to also do that on the top, but to a different degree. On the back here, what we need to do is, starting here, we're going to build up one, two, three, four. Then, across the top, we're going to take this white concrete all the way across the top, like this. And then, what we're going to do is, we're going to do the same pattern design that we just did. However, we need to, of course, once again, add another layer of white concrete, just like here, and add this again. And then what we're going to do now is we're going to, behind here, we're going to add the same pattern design. Once again, one, two, three, four. With our grey concrete, one, two, three, four, five. 
Once again, one, two, and then this time, what we're actually going to do is we're going to stop at the third block, and we're going to leave it there. And then what we need to do is, once again, build this up, and then build this up, and then build this up too, and then build this up too as well. And as you guys can see, that is the back design pretty much done for now. So now what we need to do is the roof. For the roof, this is a very simple part. All we got to do is use our white concrete and build across until it lines up exactly with this outline. The outline of this section of the house. And let's do that by starting over here. So line yourself up with this point right over here. And then place one, two, three, four. Then connect it with this wall right here. Build it up like this. And then all we need to do now is with this right here, we need to extend this out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, well, in fact, it doesn't really matter what it is. Let's just extend it out until it reaches the edge point right here. And it should look like that. And then connect it up to this point right here. Then in the middle, all along here, what we want to do is we want to add ourselves a white concrete. So let's add ourselves that white concrete. As you guys can see, there we go. And now that that is done, we need to, of course, finish adding ourselves this front part. And then with the front part, we'll connect it to the back part. So for the front part right here, what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to take our grey concrete and build up one, two, three. One, two, three. Leave a space in the middle for the door and build up one, two, three. One, two, three. And then what we need to do now is use our white concrete and build up one, two, three. And one, two, three, like that. And then in the middle here, we're going to place one block of grey concrete and then another birch door right like there. As you guys can see. And then the next thing we need to do is around here, around this edge, we're going to add ourselves black stained glass. Like that. So now that we've done that, what we want to do is we want to build up two more pillars right here. One pillar here and another pillar here. From here, where this is where we're going to start to build our door. We're going to build up one, two, three and one, two, three. Then we're going to leave a middle space here for the door and add one, two, three, and add another block here like that. Then what we now need to do, excuse me, falling off, is now add the door in place. And then of course what we're going to add is we're going to use our black stained glass and add one here and a second one there, and then connect this up like that. Now that that's all connected, we just need to build this up to the top. So as you can see, now that that is done, our next stage is to simply add ourselves some black stained glass panes. Starting from the back here, we're going to add one black stained glass, black stained glass pane there. And I'm going to continue this all the way around the edge, all the way around the edge, all the way, all the way, until we leave it right there and we can of course walk in. So. Now the main part of the house is pretty much done, but there's a few final steps that you need to take to get this house to be done. All we have to do now is to use ourselves our quartz slabs, and then starting here, build across one, two, three, four, five. So simply the width of this, and then extend it out all the way until the front of this point right here. There we go. Like that. And then of course now get ourselves some fences. And then we're going to use our fences and we're going to build down starting from the edge. So right on the edge here, we're going to build up with our fences, connect the point. Build up with our fences, connect the point. And as you guys can see, that is what it should look like. The next thing we need to do now is of course we need to finish like the exterior of the house. Because the house looks good, but it doesn't look perfect. So we're going to use ourselves our quartz stairs and right underneath here, we're going to place it upside down. And I'm going to get ourselves some leaves. And then with the leaves, we're going to place some right here, two blocks, just like that. Then on the outside right here, as you guys can see, we're going to place stairs here, stairs there, and then two quartz slabs to add some little things, basically sunbeds. Then of course, right down here, we need to make sure that we finish up the design. So add a leaf here, and then add fences here, and then, no, add fences here, and then add a piece of leaves like that. So that is what you want to do there. And the next thing you want to do is add yourself some grass in that. 
and that looks absolutely good. So as you can see, the next thing we want to do is we want to come inside the house. And of course, on the inside of the house, we want to make sure that we add ourselves some good flooring. So I like to add myself wood on these houses because it looks really nice. So let's get ourselves some wood and we're going to add this all the way across like this. So set five and there we go. And then of course, underneath here, you want to make sure you add wood too. So underneath the glass like that there and there you want to add wood. And then um, of course, the house is pretty much done right now. The last touch that you want to do is of course just add some, um, is it tulips? Yep, a white tulip. And then just scatter them about on this point right here. Don't add bone meal because bone meal just doesn't look right. Um, so yeah, just 